Hey guys, Honey Bee and Clee back with another video. Today I got another guest, Mama B. Hello. Today we are doing a snack crate. Snack crate! Snack crate! Right after we burned our tongues off. <laughs> uh, we don't know where it's from. So that's what we're about to do now. We're, we're opening now. Oh, uh, Las Vegas. Las Vegas. It's from Las Vegas. Oh, that's wait, cool. it's no. Oh, wait, it says road trip. Well, it says road trip. It says road trip. Oh, so different cities. But yeah, that's because it don't. It's okay. Pack your bags and don't bother buying a plane trip because we're hitting the open road. The United States is home to a vast number, fifty to be exact, of individual, unique, many countries. This makes the country the road trip capital of the world. Driving across the country will allow you to transport yourself from desert to forest to bustling city without whipping out your passport once, except if you tackle Alaska. While planning your trip, it's also essential to consider what the U.S. offers. Aside from the Empire State Building and the Golden Gate Bridge, <coughs> each state has its own unique set of landmarks and landscapes found off the beaten path, from relaxing natural hot springs in Colorado in Colorado's mountains to swampy bayou boats tours in Louisiana. You can make a road trip around the whole country at least 30 times and still find new places to explore. So basically, this snack crate is not any specific state, but I think... Little countries. Little yeah, cities. I think that states. States. I think that they sent us like as if we're, we're on like a that, road yeah, trip yeah. ourselves, and they sent us a little bit of something from. I. I don't know if this is what they gave us, but I think it's in that one. Okay. Well. So. Um, I believe it's the mini that we got this time through and uh, I was looking at this earlier and apparently there's some road trip trivia there's three questions I'm gonna ask throughout while we're trying everything and then uh, at the end I'll give you the answers and uh, let us know if you got them right or if you know give us your own answers to what you think it is or whatever but yeah, so let's try these out. Let's see what's in here. So we don't know what's in here. But when you open it, oh, we have a drink. That's cool. Nice. So the Little drink. Little canned drink. Um, it's Ale 81. It's fizzy with a touch of ginger. This zesty soda from Kentucky, Ooh, Kentucky. is a great thirst quencher. Or maybe a chaser. Oh, that's cool. oh. interesting. Ale eight. So one. what looks really good because it has like a little picture. Some goo goo clusters. The ooey gooey candy cluster from Tennessee, Tennessee. filled with caramel, peanuts, Ooh. and marshmallow, and coated Ooh. in chocolate. This is why I picked this one first. Looks good. I have to wrap her. Alright. Does it smell good? Mm. It smells sweet. It smells like nummies. So, this is what it looks like. So, that there that she's showing you is the Ale 8 1 from Kentucky. This and then is here the is candy? The, yeah, the, the Goo Goo Cluster. From. Tennessee. Try it out. Let's see what we got here. Mm. Oh, caramel. Oh. <laughs> she likes she it. She likes it. She likes it. It's <laughs> mm. mm. pretty good. It's amazing. Mm. It's really good. Mm, so, my mom. The 
second thing, or the third thing, that we're about to try is some chips, route, route 11 potato chips. So take with me, just potato chip. Kettle cooked potatoes. Mm -hmm. Mm hmm. So these are the Chesapeake crab chips. The spicy, briny taste that makes crabs so delicious is now captured in chip form mm, from like Virginia. It like barbecue. Obey. Am I right? It smells like barbecue. It smells like barbecue mm. chips. Barbecue chips. It does have a barbecue-ish smell to it. Yeah. Cheers. Mm. These are what the chips look like. They're pretty tasty. They even have like a like a um, crab-ish taste to it. Want to try some? No? Yeah. Try it. It's pretty good. Okay. We shall see. They taste a little bit barbecue-ish. You want to try the Drake real bit. quick? Has a little bit. You want to try the Drake Take real quick? It. Yeah. It, it is a like, little spicy. Yeah, it's a little bit spicy. It's like apple juice. Well, it's not as bubbly as I wanted it to be, but it tastes. It like tastes the water. Yeah, it tastes really good. It's kind of like a like a ginger ale. ale. Hey. These chips are good, guys. Yeah, they are. Did you? Can you get it? Or Hold on. Do you have it? Hold on. Now I do. Let me put it down. Yeah. Uh, so I do not like sparkling water, but Cleta does. So she might like this drink. Oh, that does taste like sparkling water. It doesn't really have a taste to it. it just it tastes like ginger ale to me, like a light ginger ale. It's pretty good. Wow. It's, it's okay. Different. It's different. Um, there's really no so like uh, carbonation to it. Yeah. It's but, not as bubbly as I wanted it to be. It does taste pretty but good. It, but, mm. you know, it might have like moved around a lot in the crate box while I was coming too. Yeah, it, it just tastes ginger, like a ginger ale. Like a light ginger ale. Like a really light ginger ale, but yeah. that's like 30 grams of sugar in one can. Is it? Oh my goodness. Yes. Okay, so moving uh, on. Uh, uh, this one looks interesting. Uh, it's, it looks weird. Oh, so I was that, about this one right here. It looks delicious. It is Joey's Black and White. These fluffy and soft cookies mm, cookie. from New York New will York. put you in an empire state of mind. Separate the sides or eat them as one, it's all up to you. Okay, so while she's opening that, I'm gonna if ask I you can open it. Sorry, one of the trivia questions. So number one says, what state's nickname is the first state? Say that one more time. Okay, so the question is, what state's nickname is the first state? The, the first, first thing that we state. opened, guessing, or so that's one of the questions, and I don't. I'm pretty sure I said it, but I'll give the answers at the end of everything. So that's question number one. Does it smell good? It smells like angel cake. Look at her. She really wants to bite it. It's it. really good. Yeah, try it. Ooh, and it's cookie too. Is it soft? Mm -hmm. What does it taste like? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What was? It's like shortbread soft. Mm -hmm. Like, like pound cake sauce. Oh yeah. Mm. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> wow, your viewer, viewers are gonna be like, wow. <laughs> That's definitely. Mm. It's really good. Mm. I think the white um, tastes like marshmallow or something. I don't know, but it's soft. It's almost like sponge cake ish. And then that little bit of that little bit of coating, that little bit of frosting on top is really good. I like it. I like this whole New York New New York. <laughs> I wanted to say New York cake, New York cookie. It's pretty good. I like and it. And it's called what? It's called Joey's Black and White. 
it's a fluffy cookie. Ooh, it tastes so good, guys. Like, it's sweet. Um, the frosting, for me, is too much. But for those that like sugar and sweet stuff, is going to be perfectly good for them. Um, man, it's soft. It tastes... The, <laughs> the pound cake is good. good. The huh? frosting's good. I it's, like it. It tastes really kind of fresh, too. Uh. Yeah, it's like, it's soft. It's really it's good. It's not crumbly at all. It's like really soft. This it's is from where? New York. New York. New York. Okay. So. So the next one that she's pulling so, there. It's jerky. Mm, it looks like this. Flip it so they can see the other this side. This is how it looks like. And so this is elk jerky. It's chewy and satisfying. These elk jerky sticks are from New Mexico. New Mexico. And they're packed with what great flavor and protein. Oh, protein. let's see. Let's see. Oh, jerky. Okay, so question number two. Which state's Latin roots mean arid zone? Which state's Latin roots mean arid zone? I want to look at the answer. Huh. Okay. It smells like smell jerky. Of course it smells. Yes. <laughs> bite it. Hurry. I want to bite. These girls love jerky like no other. But this is elk mm. jerky. Oh. That's good. I really thought B wasn't going to handle the elk situation. That's good. Oh, is it really? Mm-hmm. You want to try some? Oh. It doesn't taste any. It just. Tastes... Sorry, excuse me. All right. Here you it go. It tastes like jerky. Like All right. I am. I'm trying to distinguish, like, is there, like, um. I don't really eat. Distinct alky flavor or gamey flavor or compared to regular jerky. It tastes like jerky. It does. This last one, mm -hmm. it looks, sound, sounds really interesting. Hey. It's really good. That like is it. really good. New Mexico's it got is. it going on. Mm -hmm. Oh, my God. Oh, yes. I don't eat elk. Oh, it Pretty says good. elk and pork snack steak. Um, steak. Oh. <laughs> well, they did. But I do not eat deer or elk. That's just where I I am not some I don't I can't do it. <laughs> right. <laughs> Our last one is tuna jerky. Oh. Wait, oh. not not I'm not gonna say oh right now. Forgive me, guys. But I know. <laughs> I know, you said, oh, with this elk jerky, and it tasted pretty good, so. So this one is, it's Hawaii tuna. It's tuna jerky. It's a traditional, is a traditional Hawaiian snack. It's zesty, salty flavor, making it a great fuel-up bite. From Hawaii? It's, yeah, Hawaii. It's a Hawaiian jerky. So it says on the back of this little thing it has like a little thing near here area. It says the people of Hawaii have sustained their families and respected the Pacific Ocean's powerful life force for country centuries. Centuries in in Hawaii language. Uh, I'm, I'm assuming that's Kamana. Kamana? Trans translates to power of sea. Kamana. Kamana jerky has embraced the ancient art of, dry of drying fish to drive our, our jerky a great taste for the modern lifestyle. Interesting. So I'm about to open so our is it there's only three questions? Oh yeah, there's another question. So the third question is Tornado Alley is made up of what states? Tornado Tornado Alley is made up of what states? And I feel like I should know this. Like made I, of? Made of Made up of. Made up up of. Sorry. <laughs> 
It's a <laughs> cookie, eh? It's guess. a cookie from New York. <laughs> yeah, the Tornado Alley is made up of what states? Jesus. And Tornado is automatically, I think, of Kansas. So it's got to be like somewhere in the where the states, it's saying states that are made up. So I'm assuming there's like maybe two or three that are this involved with this. It smells like regular jerky too. It doesn't, I mean, I guess you can smell like the fishy scent. Yeah, that you does really... smell like regular jerky though. So Let's see, ladies. Let's see. Premium. Oh, 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 oh. Get down, get down, get down. Um, um, um. Is it good? Hmm. It tastes pretty good. I mean, you could kind of taste like the fishy, the fishy flavor to it, but even so, it tastes good. Mm -hmm. I like it. Excuse me. Jimmy, I can't really. Oh, I, I can't even get a good zoom on it. Well, anyway, that's what it looked like. Try to look like, guys. Oh, there it is. Bring it out more. Oh. All right, here we go. It's pretty good. Ew, it's crazy. Just eat all right, it. All right. Eat it. I want some more of these crap chips. I want more of the jerky. <laughs> Not for me! <laughs> you sounded like your brother. Oh, that is not for me. It tastes pretty good. All right, questions to the uh, answers to the question, please. Mm. Okay. So, um, question number one was the question number one is the state's nickname. The first state was um, Delaware. Delaware's nickname was the first state. Oh wow! Or is the first state? And then um, the state's Latin roots mean arid zone is, uh, which should have taken, should have been pretty obvious, but Arizona. Oh yeah, <laughs> I figured. Arid zone. Yeah, arid zone. Okay, and then Tornado Alley is made up of what states? And that is Kansas, Iowa, Texas, and Nebraska. Oh, wow. Okay. Tornado Alley. Makes sense. Yeah. Very cool. But yeah, it was this little, this little doohickey here. All right, well, that's it. We are getting a new one, what, next month? Sometimes, this one took a lot longer. It has been taking a lot longer for others. But we will, every time we get a snack crate, guys, we will be, we will be doing a video and sharing our experience with the snack crate. Um, we love you guys. Thank you guys for subscribing mm -hmm. and being a part of our family and our journey. We are still on our way to get subs and we really appreciate everyone that has subscribed to our channel. That does say and give comments. We appreciate y'all. Yes, we love you. And like we said before, this channel is mainly for our daughter. She really wanted to do this, so we're making it happen. And she's the brat of it, brat of this whole thing, and making us eat all kinds. But <laughs> mind you, we do not just eat and not work out. We we do our little exercises, and we make sure that we're watching ourselves healthy wise through this situation and journey with you guys. So if you guys have any other what challenges comment down below what you want us to do or mail something to us um we don't have a p.o box yet yeah we don't but we will we will give out we'll be getting a p.o box as soon as we hit a certain amount of subs yes. but um we do appreciate you guys yes subscribe turn on post notifications uh comment down below and hit that bell I hope you guys didn't want to try any more of this because Mom I kinda ate it all. You guys were talking Bye and I wasn't and it's now gone. You guys Mom. 
Say bye to the camera. <laughs> bye. <laughs>